Hey everybody, uh, let me show you what I got going on here. We're getting ready for our spring and summer. Uh, we haven't quite planted things yet, but we're working on this system we started last year with our tomatoes, growing them hydroponically. We did them in some styrofoam totes. Uh, they kind of broke apart over the winter, so we're going a little heavier duty with these 18 quart totes here. So what I'm doing is I have an three and a half inch hole saw here, which is perfect for a red solo cup. All right, let me put, put the red solo cup in there. It's got holes and this is going to be a hundred percent hydroponic. So we're not going to have any of those problems with our tomatoes that the soil usually brings with it. Um, a little pointer here. If you're drilling a hole on these totes, start off real slow and forward and once once your bit starts to go and before the big bit catches put it in reverse and drill it in reverse you won't crack the plastic and also it won't catch and jar your wrist or spin the toad and i don't know somebody might get hurt but uh look this last couple days we uh been working in the garden we built a nice little half fence to help keep the critters out it also looks nice uh we're going to try to stain it we'll see if we get to that point uh, we're building an arbor for some merlitons, and I have a little uh, passion fruit plant going on in the back there, but we still got some work to do on the arbor. We got to put a few more boards up and make it look a little bit aesthetically pleasing and maybe some trim, maybe some hog fencing, but it's getting there. Um, our garden, we got the tarp moved off. It's looking good. We're about ready to start putting our, our plants we started in the hydroponics. I don't know if you're following me on Facebook, you've seen the pictures. But uh, in the next week or so, we're going to be uh, getting the garden going. So y'all have a good one, and I'll catch you later.